Dear viewers, today I will show you some exercise for low back pain and it will help you to control your low back pain or to get better. I will suggest you to get some advice from your physiotherapist before doing this exercise. At first, I will show you extension in lying. So, this is the start of the exercise. So, what you need to do, you need to use your both hands push up all the way up and go back again we advise people to do it 10 to 15 times in one set when you do the exercise you need to make sure your lower back is not coming off from the couch second exercise i will show you extension with assistant you can use a scarf like this and I will show you how you will use this one. So this is how you do the exercise. The previous one was without any overpressure and now I am doing with overpressure. So the scarf will resist my lower back not to come off from the couch and I will push as far as I can. And another thing you can try as well, that is you can move this scarf a little bit down and do it again. Make sure the scarf is not loose. Third exercise I will show you, sustained extension. In that case, I am using my couch. But when you do at home, you can use some pillows. So this is sustained extension. So you can use some pillows to keep yourself in extension position. Now I will show you extension in standing. This is another form of extension, but easy. You don't have to use a floor or couch. You can do it anywhere. It's like portable version of extension. So what do you do? You put your hands on your back. Do not bend your knees. Keep your hands on your back and you do the extension. Make sure you do the movement from your lower back. From my experience, I have seen people doing this. Yeah. So what is happening? They are moving their neck. But our focus is lower back. So put your hands here and do the extension from the lower back. And obviously you are moving your upper back and neck as well. But main focus will be your lower back. How many times you will do the exercise? 10, 15, 20 as many time as you want there is no overdose and three to four sets a day even if you do more is good it's not harmful the second version of extension in standing when you do the extension in standing without any support some people they feel like they're losing balance they might have a risk of fall. So what do you do? You put your hands in the wall and do extension in standing. That is at least you have more control with your balance. Third version of extension in standing, you use your both hands, both thumb, put your hands here and same mechanism. Do not bend your knees. Put your hands here and push with, the, with your thumbs and hand, basically with your fist. If you have back pain and you need to do the exercise, we suggest or we prefer extension in lying rather than extension in standing. But extension in standing, you can do it anywhere. In extension in lying, you need a clean floor or a couch. But in standing, you can do while you're waiting for a bus or while you're waiting in a queue or even in your office or anywhere. 
the another information I want to give you when you wake up in the morning or if you have a long sleep even during the day if you want to do the exercise please walk around at least for 10 to 15 minutes the reason for that when we take a rest our disc start pulling the water back and it become thicker so you might find it difficult or you might cause some kind of injury to the disc so what you need to do you need to wait or and walk 10 15 minutes even you have if you have pain you still walk 10 to 15 minutes then you start the exercise i hope the exercise i shown you here will be helpful for you if you have any question if you want to know anything about the exercise i was showing here please make a comment